Who does a five-round fight favor, Dern or Jan? I would say Mackenzie Dern, and I say that because of the fact that she has such great grappling pressure, and keeping somebody off you who has a grappling ability as Mackenzie Dern's for five rounds is a very hard thing to do. And it doesn't take Mackenzie uh, Dern much to have such success with that grappling. She can start at your pinky toe, then next thing you know, she's on your neck. And, it, and it's just that <laughs> simple. It happens just like that. She's so innovative with her submission game that it, it can really take it out of you if you're trying to keep her off for five rounds. You know, I got to agree with you. I got to go with Mackenzie Dern, and it's mm -hmm. because she has something that Jan doesn't, and it's not the grappling. It's the five-round UFC main event experience. And while she didn't get the nod against Marina Rodriguez, that 25-minute fist fight that you have under the brightest lights on the biggest stage is such an invaluable experience, and Jan hasn't, hasn't, she hasn't felt that yet. So for Dern to have that in her back pocket headed into this main event, that, that's something that gives her a very big advantage, in my opinion. All right. Well, speaking of being on the biggest stage, let's say you're threatening the champion, Carla Esparza. Which one of these women is a bigger threat to her? Oh, it's a no-brainer. I got to go Mackenzie Dern again. We saw how Jan yeah. fared against Carla Esparza, and, and that was the, the, you know, within your losses, and we don't use the L word a lot here at the desk, but when you lost, when you lose, that's when you learn. That's yep. when you figure out the parts of your game you need to adjust to, and Jan has done that. But the idea of, of Mackenzie Dern's jiu-jitsu against Carlos Sparza's wrestling is a fight that I've always wanted to see, and I think that it'd be really interesting to see how that plays out. So I got to go with Mackenzie Dern having a the, having the better chance at taking out the champion. Yeah, I think it'll be Dern as well, too, because that fight's going to take place on his feet. I mean, both of those fighters are great on the ground with the grappling aspect, but that's when they normally cancel each other out, and that's when you get to see a great stand-up battle. But I think I would give the edge to Mackenzie Dern with the stand-up because of the fact that she throws caution to the wind. She throws punches from... I don't know where, yeah. but she's throwing far away. <laughs> she but she lands. When she lands, she lands with a lot of power because she's not afraid to be in a position, an inferior position on her back or on the ground because she has that jujitsu in her back pocket. Well, let's show everybody the rankings here for some perspective. This is number five versus number six in our main event. We do know, for example, guys, Dern has already fought. Number three, Rodriguez. Uh, both of these women actually have. Uh, Zhang Wei Li is fighting for the title. What would you do next? We've got Rose. We've got Andrade. You know, it, I, Jessica Andrade is sitting there. You know, both of these females have fought Marina Rodriguez. Um, you really just got to kind of see what happens between Carla and Jean Wei Li. And, you know, Rose is sitting at the top and in the number one spot. So, kind of interesting. I mean, there's really not a lot of room for these females to go up. Yeah. But it's good to hold that spot in the top five because that's a very hard barrier to break through to. Yeah, and it's really good that Mackenzie Dern is not rushing herself. She's allowing herself to have the progression that she needs in order to not only compete for the belt, but keep the belt. And I feel like a lot of fighters too many times they just want to crack at the belt, but they don't realize that once you get the belt, that's just only part of the journey. You know what I'm saying? That's just only part of it. You got to be able to pack a lunch for everything after that. And Mackenzie Dern is trying to do that. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.